Hi, everybody. Hey, Mo. How you doing? Happy New Year. I'm going to bring this up so I can. How you doing? Happy New Year. All right, let me turn it down. Mo, can you hear me? Is everything good? Hey, hey, Tanya, hey, Fortunata. Hey, Shavika, hey, Dawn. Can everybody hear me good? <laughs> hey, Amber, hey, Locke, hey, Elizabeth. Everybody come on in because y'all, it's ridiculous up in here. It is ridiculous. Hey, Beautylicious Diva. It's, it's out of control. So so let me just say it's out of control. It's, if out of control was a picture, it would be my picture. Okay? It's out of control up in here. Okay, so that's all I'm going to tell y'all ahead of time. And no matter how much I try, I couldn't get through this. So I'm going to need y'all help. Okay. Hey, Indecence, I'm really going to need y'all help. Like, for real. Okay. I hope everyone is having a great start to the new year. I know things in the world, we seem to be going through some deja vu right now. <laughs> but God is good. We are here. And we ready to declutter some stuff, okay? Thank you, Mo. Yes, please don't forget to hit that like button. Um, so, y'all, okay. Um, I stopped counting blushes when I hit 90, 95. That's all I'm going to say. I stopped counting blushes when I hit 95 blushes, okay? Your girl, everything I do is extra. Y'all already know me. This is ridiculous. Hey, Sheree. Hi, love. Everybody, y'all know I always talk about Sheree, right? She's Sheree Lifestyle. Sheree C. Lewis, but now she's Sheree Lifestyle. Y'all got to catch Sheree. Y'all know she is one of my favorite fragrance influences. I spend a lot of money because of Sheree. Hi, honey. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful new year. Um, but I'm going to go back to the 95 blushes, y'all, okay? All right? So this makes absolutely no sense. None. But we here because y'all going to help me get through this, okay? Y'all going to help me get through this because I don't know. I don't know. And and. <sighs> Oh, she not Sheree from Real House. Really, Mo? Stop it. So Mo, Mo always in the somebody get Mo always in the comments with the with the riff raps. Can you stop, Mo? No, Sheree, honey. No, Sheree is my sister from the West Coast. Okay. And every time that I'm in the store smelling something, I'm like, hmm. Yeah, I wonder if Sheree would like this. You know, and I was like, oh, I should send this to Sheree. And sometimes I do as, as well as other sales. Y'all know how I do. I'm all about sales. But anyway, yes, Angela, 90 whole five. Now, and I stopped counting at 95. Okay, so it's more than that. But we're not here to judge me. We're not here to judge me. Okay, we're here to help your girl. Help your girl get through these damn blushes, the highlighters, and... um. The bronzes. I do not have that many highlighters and bronzes, okay? That's that's not that much, right? In comparison to these blushes. This blush, I love blush, honey. So it's quite apparent from my collection. Yeah, Sheree done made me buy some stuff. Chow, she made me buy a whole lot of stuff. We're we not going to get into that because Sheree, listen, listen. When my accountant do my taxes, and she'd be like, where the hell your money went? I'm going to be like, Sheree made me do it, okay? Sheree made me spell my money on fragrance, okay? All right. All right, y'all. All right. So that's right, Angela. We're not going to judge. We're going to help me make some decisions. Yes. 
We all about the decisions. I hope everyone has a cocktail, mocktail. Y'all know I don't do mocktail. I straight up drink. Y'all know that, right? So I made myself a margarita. We're not doing a brown liquor today. Um, I had myself a margarita, but it's a large one. It's not no cute glass, okay? Mm -mm. No, because I ain't want to do no dishes after, okay? I love to see blue nail. Oh, thank you. Actually, you know what? Thank you. I just told my, my nail tech before the holidays. I said, give me something non-traditional, right? She was like, everybody does red. I said, okay, then don't do the red. So she did this and I, I, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. So yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Reminds me a little of the island of Caribbean. Yes, yes. Y'all know, hey, y'all know that I was supposed to go to Guatemala to celebrate my girlfriend's 55th birthday. We were supposed to go to Guatemala for Christmas night to the 30th, and I did cancel it. I canceled it because it was a smart and healthy thing to do. And it, things are just out of hand. So I stayed home. So no, no filming from Guatemala. I was hoping to do my first vlog from there, but that didn't work. Whoop, yes. You just had some bourbon. What kind of bourbon, Angela? You know I'm a bourbon drinker, child. Right. I don't like Malbec though. I don't like that kind of red wine, but I am a bourbon drinker. Um, Delphine, welcome, welcome, honey. It's Tom. Y'all, okay, let's get into this because I'll sit here and be chatting with y'all. And next thing you know, it'll be an hour in and out. And we have a lot to get through. So grab your drinks and your snacks. Cause we need to get through this. All right. I don't even know where to start. Let's start at the highlighters. Okay, because that's the easiest part to get through. I need these highlights. Y'all, I even have stuff over here in the drawer that I couldn't take out. Oh, my goodness, Lord. Father God, grant me the strength. Um, you know, you got to call on the Lord when you need some help, honey. You got to call on. Yeah, okay, Mo, we know you don't drink. You drink in your Sam's Club. What? Well, it's all good. It's imported all the way from Sam's Club. Yes, it's okay. All right. Let's get into it. Let's get into this. You ready? All right. Highlighters first. Anything I'm decluttering, we're going to put up here. Okay. My water is from the tap. <laughs> oh, Miss Hat. I'm one crown peach. Okay. All right. I have Patron and Margarita mix. Yep. Yeah, y'all, that Patron be doing you dirty. Got to be careful. <laughs> My daughter has a tournament tomorrow. I got to be easy. Okay. Oh, I can't even open this. So this is from Ofer Beauty. I think I got this two, three years ago in one of them boxes that I used to subscribe to. I do like, I like it because one of these highlighters is Rodeo Drive, which is the popular highlighter for Ofra. Yes, a Sunday tournament. In volleyball life, tournaments can be at any time. One is on a Monday, okay? It ends on a month, like literally. They don't care. They don't care about, you don't have a life when you're a volleyball mom. You just show up with the snacks and the water, okay? Um, yeah, so I really have not used this in over a year. So should the ground rule be no, I can't have the ground rule be if, if, if I haven't used it over a year because I have too much. But but I'm going to, I am going to declutter this one, right? Even though I really do like the one shade, I'm not going to keep it for one. See, we're doing good, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm going to declutter that. Next. I haven't even used this. It still has the little thing in it. This is a Becca highlighter in the color rose gold. You think, so Mo, you saying to pop the middle shade? That's a thought. Tanya said declutter the Ofra. Yes, Angela, no, you good. You good. You, you no more tournaments. Not me. She's a junior. I have one more year of tournaments and then hopefully college play. Do yourself do yourself really wearing it within the next six months. Okay, so you're saying ask myself if I'm going to wear it in the next 
six months. I am going to keep the Becca highlighters because you know Becca is no more. I think they might be. I forgot. Tell me who it is that they that took them over. I am going to keep the Becca. So I put it in a drawer right here just so I can put them away. Yeah, Be Becca's discontinued. Yes, Shamika, so keep it. This one right here I have used. This is Opal by Becca. I'm going to keep that one too, right? I think those are my only two Becca highlighters. The next highlighter is relatively new. I got it last year. And this is by Westman Atelier. Y'all, I can't even open this thing. This one. Pota Pesh. Smashbox. Yes, you're right, Tanya. It's Smashbox. Smashbox had, um, took over Becca or took a piece of it or something. But this is Pota Pesh. Hey, Natasha, how are you, honey? Um, I'm going to be honest with you. This is Y'all know I keep it 100. It was just okay to me. Right? For the cash, you know, it was okay. I wasn't in love. I mean, tell me, I don't, I don't know. I wasn't in love with it. It's a lot of money. I mean, if I wasn't an influencer, I, I would declutter it. The only reason I'm keeping this, is this my only, this is my only Westman Atelier highlighter. And in the future, if I wanted to use it, I, I wanted, I mean, if I wanted to say, you know, full face of Westman Atelier, you want to have a highlighter. That's the only reason I'm keeping this. And this is me being dead serious. Um, no, Angela, I would say you don't need it for this price. First of all, um, there are a lot of other highlighters that we'll get into that I think will are I, I, I prefer over this. So I, I literally, after I did that video that time, I put it away and never even thought about it again. Right. So that's me being 100 with you. I, everybody's saying hi to child, but I don't see a, Hey child. Hey sis. Happy new year. I don't, I don't think you need it. Right. In my opinion, I'm keeping it only for review purposes if I need it. But not a necessity. I would say save your money. Okay. Um, this next one, I'm I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm keeping, but I'm gonna show y'all. This is new to my collection. This is the a Dior highlighter in the shade New Glow. This one stays. I like I like this one a lot. This one was actually in my top drawer for, for everyday use. Okay. Ooh, let's talk about these fancy highlighters, y'all. So I have this, which is uh, Girl Next Door and Cheek Freak. I have this one, which is Trophy Wife. And, and... I have this one, which is Me Money and Hustler Baby. I'm going to be honest. I haven't worn any of them in over a year. First of all, I don't even use this one as a highlighter. I use it sometimes. I would use it as um, eyeshadow. But since Mother has so many gold eyeshadows, do I really need Trophy Wife in my collection? What do y'all think? I think, honestly, look, you can tell I barely used it, right? I am going to declutter it. Oh, my gosh. I am going to declutter that one. Now we have these two left. I used this more for eyeshadow at the time than this one. I am going to declutter this one as well. Oh, who's saying no? I'm saying no. What happened? Okay, everybody declutter the fancy declutter. Okay. What about this one? Should I keep one? I don't think I've used Fenty Lady. I haven't either, but I am thinking about when I want to do full face of Fenty, do I want to keep one, right? And I think I'm going to keep this one. And I'm going to declutter those two. Now. No, not the Hey, Melinda. 
not the Fendi, keep the Fenty. Oh my gosh, y'all not helping me. Oh my gosh, keep that one. I am, I'm going to keep that one, but I am going to declutter the other two, okay? I'm not done with the Fenty, y'all. These two things I'm about to show you guys, I have never used, okay? And this is the body glitter stuff. You know what I'm talking about. Like you're supposed to brush your body with it and all of that. Um, these two. What is this one? How many carrots? And this one is cognac candy. Never use either one of these ever. Okay. Um, when I'm making, you know, need my decollete to glisten and all that, I use my 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 um Soleil Blanc uh shimmering oil by Tom Ford. That's a good question. Oh, Sheree said keep one. I'm going to keep that one. Um, do highlighters go bad? I don't think so. I think it's like powder. Oh, Marlo. Hi, my love. Thank you so, so much. Hi. Never use mine either. See, Mo, so keep Kanye candy sitting by the bourbon decanter. <laughs> Stop it. Seriously. No, seriously, guys. Like, what do I'm not going to I am going to definitely get rid of the ice one right but in my I, I I use my time when I'm going away I just carry the the shimmering oil do I really need this keep the cognac candy y'all serious you keep it mm. Yeah, I believe so, Dawn. I think they act like normal. As long as it's not like a cream one, I think it I think it'll be fine. Um Hey. Hey, Issa. Have a good night, my love. Declutter it. Declutter it if you don't use it this summer. So you're saying let it pass this round, and if I don't use it this summer, all right. I'll, but I, that ice one, I'm I'm getting rid of. I'll keep this one for right now. All right. Here's another one. Anybody have this one? This is my only benefit highlighter, and I do use this one. This is Cookie. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's got like a pinky iridescence. It is very pretty on the skin. This one I keep. I never use this thing, like literally ever. And I keep the little thing in it just to keep it safe. I hate these that these things come in boxes, but it's okay. I keep this. I am keeping this one because this one I do use. So I'm keeping the benefit one. Okay, y'all, I'm keeping this one. Y'all already know. Y'all know this is my favorite. This is my number one favorite. This is I Need a New Glow by Natasha Denona. This one right here, it will be ever, forever in my collection. Okay? This one stays. Y'all already know. That one goes from nowhere. Nowhere. Okay? Now, let's get... To Dior. Dior. Dior, Dior, Dior. Y'all help me. What do I do? Um, this is a lot of this is a lot of highlight for for me, right? Like I'm trying to see which one has the most use, right? Oh, Monique said declutter Dior because you know Monique doesn't have a, a, a good relationship with Dior because you just said declutter Dior. You didn't even say declutter one, Mo. You just said declutter Dior. This one is going to be tough. Yes. Cha said keep it. The only one that I'm considering not keeping is this one. I've only used this shade. I, I don't, these other shades, they don't work for me. 
you know. So I'm considering not keeping copper gold, passing that one on, and keeping these two. I departed all of my benefit oh powders. Oh, I didn't even think about taking it out. Oh gosh, this is the one you want me to keep. It's too deep. Yes, child. This one is too deep for me. I I, I want to, I, I probably should pass this along to someone else, but these two work. I think I use this one, this shade right here the most, but keep the two you prefer. I'm going to keep these two. Oh my gosh. And I am going to declutter this one. Child, I just decluttered Dior. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm messing around with y'all tonight. Um, this one is brand new to my collection. I dipped my foot in this because it was right by the register when I was checking out at Ulta. This little mini highlighter by Jaclyn Hill. I just wanted to try it. I heard so many good things that I bought it. So I got it like a month ago. So I'm going to keep this because I still have to try it. I miss you too, Chai. I miss you too. It's time for the time for it. Okay. I will. I, I have been holding out on putting everything on my Macari until I did this part. Because the taking pictures and the posting, I'm paying my daughter to do. Because that's just team too much for me. Right? Yes, come see me and then I'm gonna come see you. I just told everybody I had to cancel my trip to Guatemala because I ain't I couldn't trust getting back in the States, you know. So let's talk about Tom Ford. This one right here. This one is Reflex Guilt. This is the duo highlighter. I do like this one. I do. You know, um, let's let's I'm gonna show you the other ones. Yes, Mo, you need to come too. Oh, we don't declutter the time for it. I have a time for regress group backup. I'm not decluttering that one, but look at this one. This one is guilt glow. These are not that old, by the way. And then Hey, Pam. Thank you for coming. This is Luna. I like Luna. I like them all. Keep because it's time for it. Yeah, I know. All right. Who am I playing with? We're going to keep the time for it, okay? I can't play myself like that. I'm not even going to attempt to tell y'all that I'm that strong because I'm not, okay? Uh. Next is Pat McGrath. This is the stick. Y'all know how much I love Mother Pat. Y'all know. Y'all know how much I love Mother Pat. Y'all know. I never use this anymore. Ever use it. Ever. <sighs> we don't declutter Pat McGrath either. Listen, y'all. I understand. But this stick, I don't use. Why am I keeping it? I don't declutter nothing, Pat, either. Y'all know how I feel about her. She, she and I, we have a special relationship. But with the amount of products that I have and the fact that this is a highlighter, I, I don't know. I It's not a favorite for me. You know, first of all, yeah, it's not. It's not. Like, I use it a little bit. And I could keep it because the component is pretty and use it as decoration or something. But it's been in my drawer for, for like a very long time. It's not now when she didn't have a lot of highlighters, it was different, you know, but now 
you know, all right, let me put it to the side. Let's go through the highlighters. Let's go through the highlight. First of all, let's take the hockey puck down because, you know, this is just decoration, right? The component is really pretty. Y'all know I love me some gold. How many of those you have? How many highlighters? We almost done with the highlighters. So it's not as many as there are blushes, right? I have all the past highlighters. This one is by far the worst, in my opinion. I only keep it because it sits up there and it's pretty as decoration or paperweight. That's the only, and I'm going to keep it only for that. Not because I could depot this and get rid of this and only keep the actual component. This was not my favorite. I was highly disappointed with this. That's just me being dead honest. Um, y'all, back in the day, we only had the option of this. And a stick. Now we have all these other options. What to do? Yes, Mo, gotta reach for her palettes a little more in 2022. Keep the pat hockey puck because it's a paperweight. Yes, that's what I'm saying. You could put it as a paperweight, a decor, but not the highlighter for me. Keep the trio. Really? Keep the trio. I don't use the trio anymore since she came out with her other highlighters. Um, I'll keep it full because I like the packaging, not because it's my favorite highlighter. Um, I I don't I don't even pick this up. I don't even pick it up. But I'm gonna keep this. I'm still on the fence about that stick. Okay. Um, this one right here. Is my favorite highlighter from Pat and one of my favorite highlighters, period. And that's the one, Golden Nectar. I forgot when this one came out last year. This one I get a lot of use out of. So this one I'm keeping. By far the bomb. Oh, I skipped one. This one. Hey, Kina. This one right here. I don't use this one either. Can't you tell? Barely used it. Um, this one I think came out right after this one and I was confused I said okay you came out with this one that was heavy as hell and the strong packaging right then you gave me this one in this plastic packaging I was a little confused you know um, I'm not in love with this one either but you know I, I'm, I tend to collect things that all things Pat McGrath but in 2022, your girl needs some space. And I'm sitting here like, mm, that stick may go. It may go bye-bye. Yes, Golden Nectar is gorgeous. Yes, Angela, it's gorgeous. So Golden Nectar stays. And you're right, Michelle. A lot of people did complain about the bulky packaging. This one right here. Uh, what is this one called? Lunar Nude. This was a good one, too. Oh, y'all know I'm keeping this one. This one I'm keeping. Can't lie, Pat's original highlighters in the trio are still my fave. Really? I don't, I don't pick it up. I don't. Maybe because they're in the drawer all the time and I always use what's in front of me. Maybe I need to do a better job of rotating my um, my products. Did you get the two new highlighters? Oh, yes, darling. They're right here. Those are the next two that I'm here to show you. Um, I actually have them on because I just filmed my review of the new items. Right? So if you're wondering what's on my eyes, it is the new six pan palette. I will reserve and not tell you how I really feel about them. And I'll let you watch the video when it drops on Monday. But this is uh, Extreme Gold. Tell me that it don't, it doesn't look like Trophy Wife. 
do you have an everyday drawer? Yes. Yes. I have a, I have a drawer that's right in front of me that has all the powders I use all the time. My favorite powders and my favorite blushes and everything shades that right here. They look similar, right? Th this one has a little more glitter, I'm going to say, right? It's not as finely milled as Pat's, which is another reason I'm really easy for me to get rid of Trophy Wife. I'm going to be honest with you. It does look like Trophy Wife, Angela. She's absolutely right. I didn't get a chance to see her video, but she's right. It looks like Trophy Wife. And honestly, um, which side did I have it on? This one? I, I only put a little bit on and then I had to I had to switch to something else. That's me being honest with you. It is they they look alike. So I didn't need trophy wife anymore. I'm keeping this one because it's prettier. <laughs> The cheeks on the cheeks, Nora, on the cheeks, it blends out sheerly, but it's still yellow. So it's still yellow. Okay. You want a comparison? Sure. So I'm going to swatch it, but then I'm going to blend it out. So this one. So it looks scary. Doesn't that look scary? Because you like, how you going to put that on your cheek as a highlight, right? And I'm, I'm going to show you. And this is Trophy Wife, right? So if you compare the two, Pat seems more um, pigmented, right? But if you, sorry, I'm using my middle finger, but if you start to blend right you see that on a deeper skin tone a, a, a more melanated woman or man or whatever it would be fire on that's trophy wife and I didn't use trophy wife for the same reason it's just too yellow right but this right here baby let me tell you, that, that is a highlight for my Melanated Sisters. It is very pretty, right? I mixed them together in order to get this side to calm down. It was just too much, too much. Hey, Nakia. But I'm keeping that one, of course. And then the other one, which is incandescent. Nope, that's not it. It can, yes, I can use it as an eyeshadow. Absolutely. Pats looks better. Yes. This one right here. Look at that. That's what I have right here. Y'all see that? Mm. Yes. So I'm keeping these. So when you have all of these, tell me, ladies, do you honestly think, honestly, I need to keep this damn stick. Hey, cat. Yes, Trophy Wife is the glitter bomb. You know, that's why I never got into it. No, Michelle, I don't need this, right? I don't need, I'm going to declutter it, y'all. Oh, my God, the first time I ever decluttered something from Pat McGrath. Lord, somebody call. No, keep the stick. Y'all killing me. <laughs> oh, he's trying to say buy stick. I'm going to be honest. I'm not going to keep the stick, y'all. I don't use the stick. And I'm trying. I really need to narrow this down. All right. So I think. Is that all? I did new glow. I said I was keeping new glow. Okay. I've done. It's such a natural. Keep the stick. Oh, my gosh. The kid's dead serious. Keep. Don't declutter pack. Y'all got y'all, y'all are supposed to be helping me. Oh my gosh. Get the stick, get rid of, keep the stick, get rid of. No, trophy wife is already decluttered, honey. Yeah, we, we got rid of trophy. Oh, I'm not done. Damn it. Here's some more. I thought I was done. I'm not. Damn, I got a lot more. Okay, hold up. All right. 
why don't you like the stick? I'm late. I, I just, I never got into it. And the stick is gold. The stick is the same gold. Like, it's a little, it's not as gold, right? But it never resonated with me like that. It didn't. I liked it. Don't get me wrong. But as people started making more highlighters, I started shying away from it, you know? I am, I, the stick is going to stay up here, y'all, honestly. So this one right here is by Syrah. It's called Dior, D, comma, O, O, R. That's that one right there, right? Um, This is my only Syrah highlighter, right? And it is very natural looking. But first of all, y'all know I'm not into sticks as it is. I don't, <laughs> let me change that. <laughs> I'm into some sticks. I'm not into stick makeup. <laughs> anyway, I'm sorry. This is a good thing all of us is grown. Um, I'm going to keep the Surratt one because this is my only Surratt highlighter, right? So I am going to keep the Surratt. I just have to pull it out more. I know y'all laughing at me. Y'all know how I get sometimes. Okay. Hey, Pam. Um. All right, y'all. I'm gonna keep big sticks only. You see how? You see y'all start. See, Chai, no better. She is no better. Get rid of the Sarai. What? You think so? It's so natural, though. You can't even see it. Okay, I'm going to put some rotten to me because now you now you got me thinking. Y'all are influencing me. Y'all influencing me. Okay, wait. Anastasia. What? Tell me what to do, y'all. I loved it for one minute. Literally, I've worn it one time since I purchased it. What should I do? Throw it away. <laughs> Mo said throw it away. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yes, that is so true. Sometimes we keep stuff because it's the only thing we have from the brand, right? And you're right, right? A lot of people saying get rid of it. Declutter HB, ABH. Macari, so <laughs> y'all say you put on Macari. Listen, I'm going to be honest. It is glittery, right? When I think about my other, my other, my other highlighters, they're always going to be used over this one, right? So this is my only Anastasia highlighter. And I've never done a full face of Anastasia. I don't see myself ever doing one. So I am going to declutter this one. I am. Holy sugar. All right. I was talking earlier about Rodeo Drive, right? I didn't realize until right now that I had it in the full damn package. You'll see how bad that is. Is that is true, Monique? People with melanin, it's hard for them to pull that off. You're absolutely correct. I am going to I am going to declutter Ofra. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna declutter this Rodeo Drive. You don't have ABH's Amrezy. The palette, Angela, I decluttered the palette last year. Sure did. I decluttered the Amrezy palette. This is just pretty. So I kept it. It's called Bali. Isn't that pretty? It's a pretty shade. I never use it. I just looked it. Looked at it. <laughs> this is terrible. Look. Shabika said keep Oprah. Y'all better help me declutter Rodeo Drive. But look at this peachy pink thing. Right? Oh, no. The Amrezy highlight I did not get, honey. I didn't get that. Declutter. Everybody's saying declutter. 
Declutter, declutter, declutter. All right. I'm okay decluttering those. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Charlotte Tilbury. Highlighter. What y'all think? What y'all think? Keep it. I have used this one time. I wasn't a fan. It is the only Charlotte Tilbury hot. Nope. No, I'm lying. I have other Charlotte Tilbury. Keep it. Keep it. Keep. Y'all all say keep it. I need to pull this out again, y'all. I do. I need to pull this out because I surely. That's, that's what y'all want me to keep? That? Trash it. Sister Charlotte, the color. Uh, that CT is for the no, absolutely no makeup look. That's what I'm saying, Bo. I'm like, I. That's that's what I get. Toss it if you don't like it. Get rid of the Tilbury. I'm not keeping this one, y'all. I can't because I literally, I, I and I and I bought that without trying it first. Um, y'all don't get real hyped. Like I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be doing this with the blushes. The blushes, I might break a break a tear or two. Okay, I'm just letting y'all know. Next, we almost done. Mark Jacobs, guilty. This one I'm keeping, y'all. I'm gonna be honest with you. I do use this one, as you could probably tell from the inside. It's a huge, huge palette, but I'm keeping this one. All right, I think we've gotten through all of my single stuff. Yeah, I'm keeping the Marc Jacobs. The Marc Jacobs stays. Now it's time for bronzer, y'all. It's not that much bronzer. It won't take us that long, right? Okay, y'all ready? This one right here. Oh, I've used this one. This one is uh, Cover FX Suntan Bronze. I don't use this side. I only, I only use this side. But it has a nice little divot in there. Right? I haven't picked it up often because I have more bronzes that are my go-tos. But I do like this formula. I, I'm, I'm what I might do is um this is the only shade that is a shade match for me from cover effects, right? So I'm gonna keep this one. I also have the Marc Jacob bronzer, this baby right here, in the shade, what is this called? Uh tantalize. I'm gonna keep this one. Ooh, Chai, what did you just tell me to declutter? Keep, keep, keep the cover. Chai, which one did you just tell me? Macari to Charlotte. I am. Anything that I'm decluttering, we'll take pictures of. Well, Maya will take the pictures and make sure it gets on Mac Macari at least within this next week or so. I do not like the bar soap packaging. Oh, stop it. Look, push past it. Push past it. That one, that's actually a very good bronzer. You would love that bronzer, Chai. Dior, y'all already know. Your girl's keeping it and, and was going to buy a backup during the sale, but said not to. I talk myself out. You can't even see the Dior sign anymore. You cannot. You can't even see it. You can't see it in this one either. Look at that. That's 07 and 08. I use them both. I use them both. So you know they stand. I actually have the Dior on today. Check out the bronze, auntie. Yes, check out the bronze. Next. Danessa Myricks. You hit pan on your bronzer, Angela? I'm impressed. I'm not decluttering. Mo, stop it. Y'all, you already knew I'm not decluttering the deal, honey. Makeup, oh, we say makeover my life. Yes, 
Dior is on point, honey. Then that's what I'm keeping. But you see, that's all I even use is that little divot inside, but I am keeping it. Wait a minute. How do I even open this thing? What is this? Girl on? This is in the shade uh brunette, Moyen Brunette 05. I don't I don't I don't like the scent. I don't like how it performed for me. This was a no for me. So I this one is a very easy declutter for me. No to the girl on. Girl on gonna go somewhere else. Okay? No to the girl on. Next is Shantakai's Goa. This one stays. This one is a nice, cool toned bronzer. So for me, when I'm ready to truly want to snatch my face where I need a cool tone, this is where I go. So this one stays. Gucci Gang. Y'all know this one stays. I, I almost bought a, a deeper shade for the summer, but I didn't. I'm glad I didn't. I didn't need to. Um, this is in the shade 04. So this one stays. Why do y'all like Chantecai? Well, Chantecai, a lot of their products are made so, you know, um, naturally and all this other stuff and help the earth. Y'all know, I don't, you know, all that stuff that I really should be paying attention to, but I don't. Um, is that utopian dream on your eyes? No, it's the new... What is that called? Br Bridgerton Collection by Pat? That's what's on my eyes today. I just filmed that video before we went live. Okay, next bronzer. I have two minted bronzers. I don't need both. So I need to open them and see which one I'm keeping. This one is Bay K. Yes. Daphne, it is. The blurring powder is everything. And this is Yacht Life. I don't even remember which one I used the most. I think it was, was it Yacht Life? I could use them both. Whoops. It was this one because this one, the thing just fell out. I had to mention, I, I did not like them like Dior. No, these are not Dior. Mm, mm -mm. No, not at all. Hey, Sansere. Keep both. Natisha said keep both. Really? You bought two backups of the blurring powder? Girl, that was too rich for my blood. I was like, I got way too many. Y'all know how many powders I have. I couldn't do it. But look. Keep one. Which one? What could be for the summer? The other could be for the winter. You know what? Never mind. I'm going to keep both of these. <laughs> Y'all know it's going to get hard when we get to these blushes, right? All right. I have two of the Hula uh, bronzes by Benefit. I have Carmel, which is my regular bronzer right this one i can't use this is like a regular a regular bronzer for me right but i have toasted which is a darker one and that really is dark darker um <sighs> I am going keep one benefit. <sighs> All right. So I'm, then I'm going to keep the caramel. And the toasted, I'm not going to keep. Oh, Jesus. Mama Kari going to be popping, y'all. Mama Kari is going to be popping. Yes, I agree, Chai, that it is good, but the packaging sucks. I did the clutter toasted. That one will go. Okay, the say bronzer I just got, right? This one I just got, I used it only one time because I was waiting to use it again until 
I got to say brush. Bronzer brush. Chai made me buy that one. Okay. Now, I need to check for your Macari for eyeshadow palettes or oh, wait until I'm on a strict no bossing of my my, I haven't put anything out there yet because I wanted to get all my declutters done so my daughter can just start snapping pictures and posting. Okay. These are the Fenty bronzers. I only one is the one I use the most, which you can tell because it's all dirty and beat up and that's Carmel Cutie. So I'm going to keep Carmel Cutie. This one here is Mocha Mommy. I don't know why I bought this. I did use it though. I think it was one one year when I was really, excuse me, tanned, and I used it. I'm gonna I'm gonna declutter that one. Okay. Yeah, I'm going. Nakia, the the Macari is gonna be popping, darling. It's gonna be popping. Okay. I have two LYS bronzers, one in strength which is dark, and one encouraged, which is tan, right? This tan one I thought was going to work for me, and I was on a LYS kick, right? Yeah, Nakia, Mocha Mommy could be an eyeshadow for me, especially if I wanted to darken something, but honestly, I have too many eyeshadows as it is. Since you get uber tan too, I know I do. That's why sometimes I need two of everything. Um, but this is the one I use the most. This is the one that is in my top drawer, which is, um, the color strength. So I'm going to keep this one, this other LYS, I am not going to keep. I'm going to put that on my Macari because it was a little off for me. Which one could be a, a contour powder mo? You talking Mocha Mommy? I feel good. I'm decluttering. I might be able to get stuff. Okay. Let's talk about this. This is Victoria Beckham. This bad boy came to my ass broke. Okay. It wouldn't even stay closed. Then finally when I got it closed, it wouldn't pop back open. And then I got frustrated and decided, see, it won't even freaking open. They were supposed to send me a replacement. Ask me if I ever got the replacement. They said when it came back in stock, they'll send it to me. I never even got it. It won't even open. The bowl. Yo, I'm not even going to fuss with it. There you go. I got it open now. So it was broken. I repressed it back in. It was out and all of that. I haven't used it yet. It's a fresh one. I'm not keeping it. I'm going to put it on my Macari and trust me, it'll be like $10. It ain't even going to be a lot. You just got to pay for your own shipping. Look at that. See? Look. Look. Watch. The bullshit. <laughs> Y'all look. I might not even post it on my Macari. This is aggravating. <laughs> it's ridiculous. What shade? Zero four. It's shade zero four. Isn't that crazy? Look, it won't close back, y'all. It won't. Look, look. No. It won't, it won't close. I'm going to have to put this one up here since it won't close. I'm going to have to say, trash it. Isn't it a shame that it won't close? I have to, like, for real? All that money for that damn bronzer? Seriously? Anyway, let's talk about, oh, oh, yes. This one right here, I'm keeping. But these are the, the intensity. This is Intensity 2 by Tom Ford. This is the Shade and Illuminate Cream Bronze Bronzer. This isn't, this is, what is it? The trash product, Angela, was this, this um, broken Victoria Beckham bronzer. 
This one is shade 03. I have not used this one yet. I got it from the cosmetic company store. So I, I had still, um, I have it in here. Can you swatch the Tom Ford? Uh, yep. That's not it. The intensity too. I can swatch. Let's make sure. But once you. Hey, Shante. So once you start to buff it in, that's what it can look like. They discontinue 03. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm keeping both of them. Yes, the Victoria Beckham, it's pricey and broken. It's crazy. But the intensity two and three, I shall keep. I'm going to organize all of that stuff later, y'all. I got to put all of this in here. It'll take me an hour just to make sure that I, I put everything together correctly back in the drawers. But that's all right. I just want to put everything that I'm keeping. In, whoop, shoot, I'm about to break something else. All right. We're almost done with the bronzers. Oh, no. So, so Danessa hit different than this one, right? What I do with it? Did I just put it? This is the only one I have, and this one is in the shade deep. I don't have the contour bomb, okay? You hit pan on intensity three. Listen, I don't blame you. You get every little bit out. I generally never stick my finger in, in my, um, let's see. You see the difference? The bronze is just different. It's a different shade. This is deep. This was too deep for me. It was, so I go very light-handed on this. That's why I've only, I've only used it twice, once or twice. I want to get it on my shirt. So, flicker. I don't use this, y'all. I don't use it. I could. I bought it because it was at the CCO, right? I just have to be very light handed with it. I think I went ham on it and I didn't like the way it turned out. <sighs> I'm not decluttering time for it. I use I can use it every once in a blue moon. When Lori used it from It's Lori Life, she made me want to take it back out and work with it. It's it's got the glitter. It's the glitterness of it. I'm gonna keep it though, because you know it's time for it, and I'm not getting rid of it. Okay. Look, it's deep on me. I mix both. You got it. I can understand that because it is deep on me too. This one right here is my Jouer bronzer. I, I have used it. It may not look like I don't use it a lot, but I have used it. What? Winnie, hi. Are you kidding me? The nuke, I, that's because they $90. I wasn't paying $90 for the blush. I wasn't. I said no. Mm -mm. I wasn't doing it. So I don't have them. I love this Jouer um, bronzer. I'm not going to get rid of it. Um, because I do like having it here for when I want to use it. So I'm going to keep it. I need to head over to the... Yes, Daphne, so do I. Matter of fact, you're going to make me want to call it. Well, Maya has a tournament tomorrow. I might call it anyway and see if they have them. Yeah. Is the concealer? Yes. Good question, Chai. Is the concealer there? I need to know that too. Because I didn't buy the concealer because it was $90 too. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. 
the CCO. They found them on the CCO in Chicago. Watch me call this. Which one? Is it on my, what is that called? Magnificent Mile, Magical Mile, something like that in Chicago? I need to know. I also need to know, y'all, look out for me. I need to know who CCO has Cafe Rose, not the decant size, not the eight ounce size, but Cafe Rose by Tom Ford and Bitter Peach. Those are the two that I need to round off my Tom Ford collection. Then I can stop with the Tom Ford. If your CCO has those, please hit your girl up. Send me a DM, comment on one of the videos, something to let me know. Because those are the only two that I need. Okay, that works for me. Thank you, Winnie. This last one I just got not too long ago. I thought it was going to be different. This is Charlotte Tilbury, medium, deep. I think she had this on sale or something. Yes, I, Michelle, we need Cafe Rose in our life, right? Please, thank you, Chai. Please let me know. Just send me a text and I'll and, and I will call them and have them ship it directly to my house because those are literally the only two. And then I have y'all. This I'm mean, not gonna turn this into a fragrance video, but just so you know, I have 17 Tom Ford fragrances. You know, your girl, everything is extra. I did declutter my fragrances. That's a whole nother video coming at the end of the month. I'm gonna drop it, but Yes. So I'm seeing it. it's too light. Declutter to Charlotte. Bitter peach smells bad to me. Michelle, I had to try it like three times, right? I don't need a big bottle. Even if it's a 30 mil bottle, a little one ounce, it's fine. I do want to have it in my collection though. You need my oh, you need my decluttered bottles? Yeah, you only have two. Listen, don't don't be out of control like me. Do I have Montclair? Montclair? I don't know what that is. Sansere. You gotta you gotta send me a message with the bottle so I know what, which one it is. Declutter the Charlotte Tilbury. I just got it. And y'all saying get rid of it. I think y'all right though. Cause what I'm supposed to do with that? Don't it look kind of ashy? It look kind of ashy, right? Yeah. Oh, my decant, decant bottles? You know, I don't want... Oh, you want me to send you some decants? Shy, is that what you're saying? You want me to make you some decants? It looks invisible. Yeah, I think this was a bad buy for me. I, I'm going to... um. Push it off and put it on Macari. Somebody else can use it. Oh, shoot. There's some more right in front of me. All right. Y'all know I'm keeping this one, right? Oh, this the Charlotte Tilbury one. This one stays. Now, this. Patrick Todd. I'm waiting for y'all to tell me. <laughs> Michelle said trash. <laughs> so I know my husband puts he put in his will he's gonna pay on the RTV. That's right, he's pay on homage. Because he just passed away. Keep it. How do you feel about the Patrick Top? It was all right after my video. I never picked it up again. From a cream blush perspective, right? I would prefer to use the say the top word, you know. Um, and I'm not big on like cream bronzers. I mean, so I never picked it up, and I don't see myself doing a full face. And like Patrick Todd blushes all day long. He can get my money. This right here. I wasn't, it was, I wasn't a fan of, and it came out right after the Wayne Goss one, and I was like, yeah, and actually, you know what, I don't know if I need it, but it 
it's a clean product. I don't think I'm gonna put it on Macari. I mean, I only use that little part right there, but it's a clean product. A clean product. I can't sanitize a clean product. You know. Um. So I don't gonna put this on a baby pile because I, I don't know if I'm gonna keep that. This is the last one. Can we get into the rosa? I do. You're right. I have too many good prop, like great prop options to keep the Patrick top. You know, because why keep it when you're going to use it? Look at this one. Y'all know how I feel about this one, right? This is the way Goss one. It worked for me, but barely. Right? It barely worked. It barely showed up. I never picked this up. After I reviewed it. Ever. And I won't. And I won't. So honestly, I'm decluttering. Wait. Wait. She you said keep because it's bomb, but I don't I don't use it, Chai. I don't use it. There's no deeper shade. This is the deepest shade, right? So once someone hit, you knew I couldn't touch this bronzer because literally I couldn't. Um, I know Chai. Chai's probably like, girl, if you don't keep that, keep the sculpting side. Oh, I have Wayne Goss in my beauty lunch cart right now. Chai's like, you better keep it. No, don't, don't declutter it. I don't use it. I don't use it. You say keep it for a future video. I own those most of my car and defend it. We ain't got it. <laughs> it's not about defending. I literally, I would have to build this up so much. And I had my Dior. I had my Dior. Look, Dior took over my whole bronzer life. You know, um, all right, I'm going to hold on to it for right now. But I'll, if I don't pick it up by the middle of the year, I might do a mid-year declutter and get rid of it. All right, y'all. Listen. We're an hour in. And now we got to start the real talk. The real talk. I got a fresh whole drawer right here. And I don't know what to tell y'all. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't even know what to say about what's about to go down. It's the contour. Okay, Chai. I'm going to I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna try the contour side again and see. Because you know, generally I don't contour like that. I use my brush, my my brush, my bronzer to contour, right? Because I prefer like this contour. I use my bronzer because I prefer prefer a warmer tone contour, even though contour is really supposed to be you know, with a cooler tone product. Anyway. Okay. Y'all ready? I hope y'all ready. It's blush time. First of all, let's start here. This this stays, because this is a curated palette that I made with the do y'all know Mac doesn't sell these blushes at this size anymore? Because I've been on there trying to get one more just to fill the thing, and I can't get it. But anyway, this is my MAC blush collection right here. This is it, right? And I do use it all the time, right? And I use it on other people. So when I have to do somebody else's makeup, they're like, and that happens, even though we're in the middle of a panini. It happens. They like Chris. I have a photo shoot. I have a this. Can you do it? And I'm like, yeah, okay, fine, whatever. I use this on the majority of everybody because there's something in there for everybody. All right, Lord, I'm getting anxiety, y'all. Okay, I bought this last year with every. Ooh, see the thing still in it. Every intention on using it. Every every intention on using it it is by sephora it is the sephora pro face palette 
It has blushes. It has the contour and the, uh, what do you call it? Bronzer. And then it has highlighters. So I see. Declutter Sephora. Keep it. It's so good. Declutter. Hey, Jamila. So I have it in the deep. And then I also have it in the light, which is this version. So do I declutter the light and keep the deep? It's so pretty, but I, I, I haven't used it. Keep it for your bride clients. That's a good that's a very good point. I can just put these in my kit. You make a good point. I could do that. You're right. So you know what? I'm going to put this down here. It's not going to go in my drawer, but it'll be in my kit. Yes. Very good idea. See, that's why y'all here to help me. Okay? Y'all helping a sister. It's going to be a long session. Dawn, it's going to be hella long. I'm going to tell you right now. This is Too Faced. This is old, this is old but not real old. I used to use this all the time. As you can tell, that was my favorite blush color right there. It was, it was my favorite blush color. I didn't use the bronze or anything. I just used that blush. I can't even put this on Macari. It's so beat up. I'm going to uh, depart ways with it. I am going to, this is, in case y'all wondering, the natural face by Too Faced. I'm going to declutter this one. Um, it's too heavy to go up there. I'm going to put it down here. This is brand new. Y'all remember when I declared, when I um hauled this last month, I think, or when I was doing my Sephora haul? That's this one right here. So I'm going to keep it because I literally, I just got it. I'm going to keep it in the box though so it doesn't, doesn't break. I did declutter the Too Faced. Get rid of the Too Faced. I did. I did. I'm keeping the Sephora. I'm keeping the Mac. We know that. <sighs> Y'all ready? Chris said, "Shop." Yeah, I did. I stopped counting at ninety five. All right. The Saharan blush is from Julia's place. Oh my gosh, the thing is still on it. Have I never used this? No, I've never used this. Hmm. I never used it, y'all. That orange is pretty, though, but I never used it. <laughs> this is horrible. I never used it. What shall I do? I'm waiting for the comments to pop up. That's good. Use it. This one, Macari. Always wanted to try Juvie's Space. Want to sell it? To clutter, sell. Y'all are all saying sell it, but you know, why well, I'm gonna sell it for five dollars? You could get it for like eight dollars when it when they having a sale. I have not used this. I feel terrible. I I forgot I even freaking had it, and I'm not gonna use it. That's the thing. I am going to declutter it. I'm not gonna use this, y'all. Y'all saying keep it, Kara. Saying keep it, Natisha. Saying keep it. I love that blush palette. I use it for blush and and shadow. Hmm. You like luxury stuff, but even I, I actually use some things that are not lux like luxury luxury products. But I don't. I don't know. Put it in a gift. That's a good idea, Jamela. I am going to put that. I'm going to make a gift. Yes, I will put it in the giveaway pile, y'all. That was an excellent idea. Okay. Now, this just came out, right? I forgot when this came out. What is this? The Love Cheek Duo. I use, as you can tell, that side right there. I'm going to keep it because I dug into it and it's, and it's a um, cream product. So I am going to keep that one. I don't. 
I think I used this one. Nope, I'm lying. Oh, yes, I did. I used this one. And I think I used that for a transition shade, not even for a blush. But this, what I what should I do, y'all? I think I'm I think I'm gonna give this one away. What are y'all saying, Keith? I don't I know the comments are coming up slower than what y'all saying. Declutter the Sephora. All right, I'll declutter the Sephora. Okay, this one. NARS orgasm. Y'all remember that came out last year. Give it away. I like it. Okay. This I haven't used yet. So before y'all make a decision, before y'all make a decision on that one, I have this one that I just got not too long ago too. Right? I like these colors better than these colors. What do y'all think? Or should I keep them both? Dawn's gangster. Dawn's like the glut of the NARS. <laughs> I'm like, I like this one, especially that orange. For the summer, it might hit different. I think this is the one that I have to get rid of. I've never used it. All I did was take it out the box. But I like the idea of giving it out in a giveaway. We're going to have a nice little giveaway. Ooh, no, that's not the giveaway, pal. This is the giveaway, pal. Okay. Yes, the quad wins. Because look at that. Look at, I, I, yeah, the quad wins. I, I like that. Okay. Next, keep the quad. Oh, I don't know the, the shade names now. <laughs> yes, it does. Torrid, Exhibit A, Savage, and Taj Mahal. Yes. So that's the one I'm going to keep. This right here, y'all already know. This is the Louis Vuitton one. That Not Louis Vuitton, I'm sorry. I'm thinking about my pocketbooks. The Christian Louboutin. One, I'm keeping this one because I actually really enjoy this one a lot. <sighs> this one, this is Love Gasm. This is old, but I, y'all can tell, I have really loved this one. This was like my go to number one, number one, um, to use. I don't, I think that this. The bronzer part dried out, I think, right? Because that was like a cream product. But these still work. I'm going to keep this one because I actually, I should have bought it when it came back out. I'm going to check. I don't think it's out anymore. I gave this a lot of love. I'm keeping this one. Oh, Sansere. It is so great. I, I really, really enjoy it. And it was like everything I needed. The blush, the highlighter in this bronzer worked on me so i would carry this whenever i was going somewhere instead of trying to take a bunch i i love it i absolutely adore it okay this is my only benefit blush and it is in the shade uh what's the shade name i don't even see the shade name it's hmm. interesting Anyway, this is the shade. She's beautiful. So she, I keep. Yes, Jamila, the Golgasm one is not for us. I'm going to keep this, this benefit one. All right, y'all ready? Let me go through this little section right here. Y'all ready? Y'all saying declutter the benefit? Y'all gonna make me declutter it. <laughs> y'all serious? All right, wait. Because y'all gonna help me, so I have to listen to y'all. Right? That's the shade. Can y'all see it? 
That's what it's called, California. That is, I couldn't figure it out. You're right. It is a great shade. Okay, I'm keeping it. I'm keeping it. Let's go into these before we get into these. This whole side. The whole side. Okay. Natasha Denona Bloom. This is a hot, the little mini one. I think I'm going to declutter this one. I don't wear it anymore. It's pretty though. She pretty. The declutter. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna declutter it. I'm gonna declutter it. I'm gonna declutter this one. I said I was keeping. I'm decluttering it. <sighs> I'm getting emotional. Okay. This one here. GG Gorgeous. I don't know. I got it in a bossy charm two years ago. And I had kept it because it was an interesting color peach that I didn't get in, in, in um a see a lot of, right? So I kept it, but I haven't used it but once in the two years since I kept it. So I'm gonna declutter it. I'm putting the declutter ones. I'm gonna put them right here for right now, just in front of me. That is, which one's pretty? Hey, Lisa, which one's pretty, Lisa? See, it's hard. You can't benefit over ND. I did because this ND, right? It has a little shimmer to it or whatever, but I, I haven't picked it up, child, so I left it. This is pretty. But I think this is similar to Does It Work It? It packed, so I'm not going to keep that. All right, I have all of these things. What am I gonna do, y'all? I have nine of these Fenty Beauty Cream Bronzers, nine. Nine. I don't need nine. Keep the cream, fin the um, anti cream bronzes. Declutter the tenth cream. I only have nine. I don't have ten. <laughs> Sometimes it's not about the names. More so, to actually use it. Yeah. The only one of these that I used often. Where is she? She's the messy one. Is Fuego Flush. Fuego Flush. <laughs> Is all nasty looking, but Fre Fre Fuego Flush is the one that I use the most. I would keep this one. Some of these other ones I haven't even used. Oh, but this little purple one. It's not smelling yet. I think I'm going to leave this one. The rest of these going. The rest of these got to go. I'm not using any of them. No, I'm not. I, I used this probably once. This is strawberry dip. Y'all, I ain't using these. Um, I never used this one. Bikini martini. I mean, not even a swatch. I'm going to put that one to the side. The ones that I haven't even used are the ones I could put on my Macari. The ones that I've swatched, I'm going to have to see if I can find a home for them. Um, this one I have used. Petal Popping. I've used that, that, that one a lot, actually. I'm so surprised I used it that much. I really must have liked it at the time. At least try the purple one. I do. I, I tried the purple one. Oh, I used this one, too. Daiquiri Dip. That one, you can see how nasty it looks. Hmm. Maybe I did use them more, but I haven't used them. Mm, this one. This is messy. I'm only keeping the two I pulled out. That's it. The rest of these, if I never use it, it'll go on Macari. Okay. 
So I've used the rest of these. The only one I haven't used is Bikini Martini. So that's the one I need to go on Macari. I'm going to put that up there so I don't get it messed up. These I need to find homes for. I'm not keeping all of these cream blushes because they go bad, right? I'm going to keep the two right here. I'm decluttering these. All that goes to the side. Now, these Tower 28 blushes, I haven't used yet. They're brand spanking new. I heard they were real good. So I wanted to have them in my collection. Oh, wait, I'm lying. I used this one. It must have not been wowed me because I don't even remember that I used them. I'm going to be honest with you. All the rest of them look brand new. D Daphne, I, that's why everybody told me to get them. So I got them. I tried it. I could tell I tried this one. But I haven't used the rest of them. I'm going to keep them. I have to show my cream products a little more love, a lot more love, because I'm not paint, I'm not doing well with them, right? This one right here is the little Chantakai one that never shows up on my face. I have tried and tried and tried. It barely shows up. If you want to no makeup, no makeup, like literally you wake up in the morning and you... And you want to look like you woke up like this, you might want to throw a little on, but ain't nobody going to really tell. Right? This is Smitten by Chantakai. This is my only Chantakai blush. I, it doesn't show up. Can't you tell? It's not really going to show up on me like that. But I paid good money for this. Look at it. You can't even barely see it on my little pinky. I'm going to declutter the Chantecai. Lord Jesus Christ. I am going to declutter it. I'm going to sanitize it and put it on my Macari. Somebody may want it. Okay. What's this? This is my Suku blush. This is new. I just got this not too long ago. This one right here. So I am going to keep that one. That's my only Suku blush. Then I have my Becca blush, Becca blushes. Say that five times, Becca blush. This one is Snapdragon. Yeah, she stays. Y'all know all my Becca stays, right? This one is Nightingale. Isn't she all? Oh, she is so pretty. Oh, okay. She stays. And this one is really used. This is a uh, fox glove. Can you see the divot inside of that one? I used to wear this one every day. It was like I had a relationship with this one. It was crazy. Then we have this one by Estee Lauder. I couldn't wait to get because of the design and didn't want to use it because of the design. But isn't she pretty? Isn't she pretty? Oh. I have to take her out and use her, but she's pretty. And the shade is gorgeous. The shade is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so look, we emptied a whole piece out in half of this. Okay, so we're, we're doing good so far. This is brand new. This is the only one. You decluttered your Becca? Oh my gosh. Lord, declutter the S day. Doing you gangster. Doing you being gangster tonight. You said declutter the S, S day. You probably right. Look what she's so pretty doing. I never, I don't think I ever used her. I don't think so. Doing you probably right. I don't reach because she's in the drawer. Hey, Terracotta Kim, what's up, boo? Keep it. All right, I'm going to keep it for this round. I'm going to have to make a, a conscious effort to, to use it 
This Giorgio Armani blush is the only blush that was in stock. So I grabbed it. She's beautiful. She is beautiful. What's her shade? Shade number 45. So she stays. And she goes in the top drawer. Because I need to make sure I use her. All right. All right, y'all. Now, oh, here's another one. Another, I thought I got all the palettes out the way, but I didn't. This one is the Natasha Denona Nona Bloom palette. This one just came out not too long ago. So I am going to keep her. Put her in here with the rest. No, I didn't declutter the... I love orange blush, so the Becca didn't make the cut. Wow. I kept. I got to keep those three Beccas. The rest of the Beccas, I didn't need. This one, can you swatch the Armani? I sure can. Y'all, I don't think y'all understand. First of all, let me do that. So you can understand. She's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. In the summertime, child. It is gorgeous. Okay, y'all. I have... What? Chanel's about to drop a color range extension for the foundation and, found, and all their foundations, I'm wondering. And four new blush bronzers. Okay. I hope so. I really do. I have all four minteds. I don't use all four minteds. So we need to pick a shade. Oh, this one broke on me. But I do use this shade. Next, this shade. This shade is clay too much. I don't use this shade because it looks more like a bronzer. I don't use that shade. This one I do, right? This is peach for the stars. So this one I use. You said keep clay too much. You saying keep this one. I don't even use that one like that. Then this one. Peaky promise. I've actually used this one too. You know what? I might have to keep all of them. Mm, I really don't use this one. I'm going to just keep them. I can't, y'all. You know, this is this is the problem. This is exactly the problem I had before when I tried to do this with um and tape it. I just couldn't get through it. I just tapped out and said bump it, right? But I really need to clean some of this out. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get through this. These go nowhere. I'm gonna just show these to y'all, but they go nowhere. Okay. These are my Suku blushes. And in case, uh, not Suku, Surat. And in case y'all didn't know, Surat is the bomb. The blushes are everything. So this is a set. And this is another set of shades. And this is my last set of shades right um and it's not one that i am mad that i have they are all everything these they all stay all of them can you swap so swat? yeah sure i could swatch the Surat ones now y'all the shade names because the way you buy them is you buy the little color and then you have to buy the palette and drop it in so i had glued the shades onto the back 
And other than these, none of them stay. So please do not ask me what shade it is because, child, I am not going to know. But I will swatch them nonetheless. So we can start with the lightest one. And some of these are going to be light. Oh, I just put that over the Armani. Hold up. Some of them are going to look light, but they're buildable when you put them on. So don't, don't look and say, wait, wait, that's too light. Because it's really not. So this is like a pinky, pinky one. And it does build up. Y'all, this one is just not going to show up. It shows up on my cheek, but it's not going to show up on my hand. I think this one is cantaloupe, if I'm not mistaken. That one gives you a nice wash of orange. This I only pull out in the summertime. And then this one, which is really, really orange. And you can mix the two. Like if I was to put the other one over it, and then it comes out to this, this like beautiful wash of orange on. I mean, it's gorgeous. And then when you're applying it, it just melts into your skin, right? I love it. I absolutely love it. I want to say one of these two is cantaloupe. I can't remember, y'all. But, I mean, look at it. Do I have their eye batons? No. I only, I have their, um, they had sent me PR last year um, when I had done one of, one of um, the foundation video. As a thank you, they sent me PR. Um, and they sent me the singles. I have 10 eye singles. They were all right. Nothing to write home about. Not for me, at least. We're going to do these. It's this shade here. Then we have this middle shade here. Y'all, y'all already know. And then we have this dark purple shade right here. So those are those shades. Me too. I loved that they sent the PR because I, was, I wasn't I was even at 1,000 subscribers at that point. Um, what's the finish? It's a uh, matte finish for the most part. There's no real glitter in it. It's not a satin finish. Um, and y'all know I love me a matte. Um, actually, you know what? This one you might consider slightly. It's got a little speck of shimmer in it, but not much. It is like a cream to powder. It's not creamy, though. I can't even explain it. It's matte, though. It just melts. I have never seen a, a um, powder so light, delicate, that just blends into your skin. I love it. You think she's, don't tell me she's giving bronzers and cream blushes because I've been waiting. I just need some bronzer in my life. She just needs to do the bronzer. Okay. She needs to do bronzer for me. What's, what's my shade in clay to po? Um, B90. B90 is my shade. So this is that shade. I love these. Look at that. Y'all, and it's just a swatch. And you see how pigmented it is? So you do have to be very, very, very light-handed because otherwise you're going to be blending and blending, trying to calm it down. I know that from experience. She is my London friend, works for her. Okay. I, listen, that would make my entire year if she comes out with those. Here's the last set. So we're going to do this top, this top shade first. Here's the middle shade. And then this is the last shade down here. And again, these are swatches, but when you blend them out, they just blend out so seamlessly
Hey, Vicky. I love Sarai bl blushes. They're everything. They are everything. Vicky. Happy New Year, sis. So these all my Sarat blushes, they all stay. They all stay. Okay. Now, can we talk about the Hermes? Let's talk about them. This one was Rose Palmette. Now I didn't even show them all Winnie and you like keep all the Hermes. <laughs> um, here is Rose Nui. And then this one is Rose V. Nui? I don't know. How do you really feel about Hermes? I'm not impressed. I'll be okay getting rid of two of them. Right? So I, I, I honestly think I'm going to keep which one? The darker one. Yeah. This one. Keep the last Hermes. Yeah, I'm going to keep this one. Right? This one right here. This one and this one I'm going to let go. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Lord T. Jesus, I'm only going to keep the one Hermes. The other two I am going to put on my Macari. <sighs> wow. Okay. I had to take a moment, y'all, because I didn't think I was going to do that. Because when I was by myself, I just was like, nah, I'm keeping them all. <sighs> okay I'm going to keep this one Y'all I have Like I said I stopped counting at 95 We ain't even halfway through this So I just note that Okay so let's talk Sicily Ooh all right, let's talk Sicily before I get emotional because y'all 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 don't even understand what's about to go down. Okay, so we have Rosewood. <laughs> we have Rosie Fuchsia. Damn, <sighs> and we have Coral. Hey, Coral, y'all, I do use because it's dirty as hell. I use this one. You can't even see the word Sicily almost anymore. I keep this one. All right, I'm keeping all the Sicily. I got to, y'all. I can't. I can't even make the decision because they, they, <clears throat> if I had my choice between Sicily and Hermes, it would be Sicily. I feel like I should get rid of one. Nah, but I'm not going to. We're going to keep the Sicily. We're going to keep. <laughs> we keeping this Sicily. <laughs> I didn't bump my damn head. We keeping them. Okay. We're going to keep them. All right. This is y'all. This is. This shit is hard. Okay. Um. Chanel time. And these are the original formula. It's not that new shit that they have now. Okay. This is the original. Okay. All right. Um, this shade is rosewood. Chai already said, keep the Chanel. <laughs> This one is uh, Fosha Rosa. I don't ever pronounce it right. 
to keep the I try to keep the caps on them. That's like a a peachy one. You can sell them for a bunch of money. <laughs> I'm gonna keep these are my only two full ones. These other ones are the ones that came out last year. Actually, this one is the new one that came out last year. What's the name of it? Rouge Profound or something like that. No, that's not. It didn't come out. It just changed the packaging when it came out with the red packaging. Hey, Pam. Happy New Year. So oh, I'm keeping this one. All right. The Chanel has to stay, y'all. Y'all know damn well I can't, I can't get rid of the Chanel. And this one right here. This was the duo, duo that was the highlighter and the blush. I'm going to keep that one, too. Okay. The red the packaging is limited edition. Yes. I'm going to keep. All of the Chanel. I would like I would like to tell you that you can keep all your products and powders. Yeah, I know. Those new ones this year are seventy dollars, and I tried to see them in person today, but they weren't in yet. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Chai said, Chanel, Surratt, Sisley, and Pat McGrath blushes do not declutter. I am not keeping everything, Pam. I've been doing good, girl. I've been doing so good. I've been doing good. I'm so happy. Keep the Chanel. I am. I'm keeping the Chanel's. The Chanel's will go in here. I'm keeping the Chanel's. This is emotional. Honestly, y'all, as I look, I don't know if there's anything that I'm not keeping, but that's left. But we're going to see. So we, I have three Charlotte Tilburys. And I think I'm keeping all three. This one right here is so dirty. This is Walker No Shame. This one stays, right? Um, are you getting the new ones? Yes. I can't even. Yes, because they in my cart already. And I said I wasn't going to click purchase until I got rid of something. Right. Um, what's this one? This is new. Oh, this is one I just hold. This is the uh, intense. What is this? Pillow talk intense. Right. I just got that one. And love is a drug. Oh, this one I can get rid of. Love is a drug. Love is a drug ain't for me. So I can get rid of this one. Okay, I'm going to keep these two Charlotte Tilbury and I'm going to get rid of this one. I don't even know why I purchased. I think I bought this one online because it looked like it would work. But, mm -mm. What shade do you have that's too deep, Chai? I, I'm going to get rid of this one, okay? I feel better, okay. <laughs> You gotta try Morena Beauty Blushes. It's a back black on brand. They have a single sale now. You buy one, you get one. So you gonna make me spend money. We supposed to be decluttering. You telling me what to go buy. Okay. Dior. And he's a Dior. I have six Dior blushes. I'm gonna be honest with you. Not near one is probably gonna leave. But we can walk through them together. Okay, in case there's something that I'm missing, I'm holding on to, you know, I can get emotional about Dior. Okay. Um, this one right here is Autrice. Autrice stays because Autrice gets worn. This one is Poison Matte. She definitely stays. Dior, y'all don't understand. They know how to do a blush. Oh gosh, this one is so bomb. This is just triple nine, 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 nine. She is gorgeous. I did not get any of the house tooth collection yet. I say, yeah, y'all caught that anyway. Oh, I might get rid of this one. Rose Caprice Matte. She is really light, really light. I will get rid of this one. I feel better. I feel like a big girl. I'm a big girl today, y'all. 
this is the new one that came out. Y'all saw me haul this one, right? Y'all remember that one? That one I'll keep. So I'm not gonna, I'm not until the out of this part of my collection, I'm gonna get rid of this one. These two are discontinued. So these stay. I talk about, I've talked about these before. This one is this is the Dior, Dior Skin New Luminizer Blush in the shade 10. She's bomb. She is bomb. And this one has been beat up, but this one right here in the shade 11, bomb. Can you swatch the new one? I sure can. So she's, she's, she's coral. She's, they were serving the coral up. Look at that, y'all. She's beautiful. Beautiful. Yes, Dior's blushes last long. You mean last long on the skin or last long for shelf life? Because they're powder, they last long, right? Um, the powder products, they last long. But lasting long on the skin, absolutely. You get a nice long wear. You don't got to worry about your mask. You know, it pulling off on your mask or whatever. This shade is everything. Look at that. It's a nice flush of color. It's perfect for the spring, summer. And that's what I have it sitting on the side for. So I had two, four. I had seven, not six Dior blushes. Now I have six. This one is the one I'm decluttering. It does last, um, Lisa, on the skin. It really does. I Dior knows how to do blush. They really, really do. Okay. I guess we need to do Tom Ford next. Oh, sweet Jesus. Okay, let's do. Let's 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 just get this done. Let's let's get it done because I have two, four. Six, seven, Tom Ford's. So let's let's get it done. This one is disclosure, not going anywhere. Disclosure is is the bomb. Um, this one is wicked. Wicked ain't going nowhere either. Wicked is the bomb. Flush. Flush look a little like wicked, don't it? Wait a minute. Nope. No, it doesn't. So this is flush. This is wicked. They're similar. I'm not going to lie to you, but I'm keeping them because I'll be lying to tell you. I use wicked. I haven't used flush yet. I think I forgot I had it. I think it was in the drawer. I'm keeping these because, you know, I got these from the CCO, right? This one, though, gratuitous. Look at that. Look at that. I'll wait. Admire virtually, y'all. Look at that. This is the old formula, right? The non $90 formula. Look at that shade. Y'all see that? Do you see that? It's it's like an everyday shade. Y'all see that? It just gives a little bit of like a plum shade. This is gratuitous. She stays. I knew I wouldn't get rid of no damn time for it. Uh, I just knew I wouldn't. Why did he? Do, I don't. Why he did those duos? Like he? I don't know, Vicky J. I don't know why he did it and I haven't done it before you got on the live someone said that they're already at the CCO so $90 for the duo I, I wasn't doing it this is the incand incandescent duo y'all know I'm not getting rid of this right 
Y'all know I'm not. I got it. I found it at the CCO. I'm not getting rid of it. She stays. Winnie, you have to shop around at the at the CCOs and see and see if um if you can find them. Okay, they are. You saw them, Kim, because that's what that's what someone else said. His prices are going up so much. They are. They really, really are. Okay, these are my last two. These are the duos. This is Exotic Flora. I'm keeping her because I use her every summer. What's the name of the duos? The duo you have. Which one? This one right here? Incandescent. Let's see if I can show it. This one is Exotic Flora. She's pretty. And then, and I always mess this up. Lessome, L I S S O M E. I use this one too. What's wrong with the new top? I don't know. I just don't like the price, Nikia, at all. Um, oh, Lost Cherry. Lost Cherry does get lost on you, unfortunately. It disappear after about two hours, three hours. I don't care, though. That's why I got a 100 ml bottle, because I love that damn fragrance. I really do. Okay, so we keeping all the time for it. We keeping the Tom Fords. We keeping the Dior's. Y'all, this is crazy. I'm, I'm going to have to straighten this out later. Okay. These two Chantecais. Y'all know I decluttered the other Chantecai, right? But these two I am keeping. These two are discontinued. And I love both of them. These are the Radiant Cheek Cheek and Highlighter Duo. This is Coral and this is Rose. Whoops. These right here. This, this one is my favorite. The, the, the Coral one is my favorite. Actually, you know what? As I'm looking at this, do I want to keep both? I'm going to keep the Coral one. This one, though, damn, Chris. What do y'all think? What do y'all think? I think I have so many pinks and highlighters. I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to put this one on Mama Cardi as well. I think I'm going to do that. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just keep this one. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, let me take a drink. I'm going to keep the coral. That's it. Oh, I forgot I had this. This is the Anastasia Blush Trio. This is Peachy Love. And I had kept this. I had decluttered the rest. With my declutter last year. And I kept this because I didn't have a lot of oranges and peaches. Right? Yes. Dawn, that's what I was saying. The highlighter in the pink is fire. But I have all those other highlighters, right? That that I kept. So I'm I'm okay decluttering that one, even though the highlighter is fire. Okay, no, no, no. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to declutter this, y'all. I was holding on to it, but now I have oranges. I'm going to let this one go. I'm putting stuff up here and up here. That's that's decluttered and down here is decluttered. I've just got decluttered everywhere. I have not used that ABH in not even one year. I haven't used it in two years. So I'm going to let it go. I'm 
gonna tell you right now, I think the rest of what I have, I'm keeping, but we're gonna go through it because I might change my mind. So let's talk Patrick Carr. Y'all know I love Patrick Carr blushes, right? Ooh, I just opened that on my finger. I have not used this one. Oh, she different. I didn't realize I haven't used her. Get the hell out of here. I've used she that girl a little bit. A little bit. I have used the hell out of this one though. This one I've used. This one is do we know her? Do we know her stays? Do we know her? I use all the time. Okay. Why did I not realize? No, I never used this one. Oh, she different. Holy crap. Okay, wait, we're going to have to open all these. The new one I'm keeping. This new one I'm going to keep. Okay. Holy crap. Y'all, I haven't used them. I haven't used this one. If I haven't used it. All right, I'm keeping them, y'all. I just have to remember to go back and I have to start. I'm going to have to start cycling them because I think what happens is my, I have my desk. And then on top of my desk, there's a, another piece that's on top that has two drawers, right? It's for my kid. Y'all seen them in other people, in other people's videos. And I keep powder that I reach for, blush, bronze, and highlighter that I reach for. And I don't rotate them enough. So things speak. Speak. Things stay in, the, in here. And then I forget to take them out and rotate but I'm going to do a better job of that because I'm, I'm not going to get rid of my Patrick Carr. We're going we're gonna to figure it out some other way. Pam, I, yeah, a lot of people have have um, a hard time finding pa Patrick Carr because they, he does stay, it stays sold out. It stays sold out. The next set of blushes is Wayne Goss. And I do love these blushes, but I'm going to be honest. I don't use them all, right? So let's 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 roll through them and see which ones I honestly need to keep and which ones I can part with. Because I'm really trying not to be a hoarder, right? This one stays because, well, she likes this. She likes both, okay? She likes both. She, she bees me, okay? <sighs> mm -mm. I can tell you right now, I know one I'm going to get rid of. Maybe two. This one right here. Bright Poppy. I'm going to keep this one. And I'm going to keep the last one I just showed you. These other two right here, Blush Peony and Coral Rose, I'm decluttering. Holy crap. I lost my damn mind up in here. Yeah, I'm going to declutter these two. You should have a rotation. I, I should. You're absolutely right. Actually, that's that's a great idea. And just show my rotation. Um, you have those shades in Pat McGrath and Tom Ford. Look at Pat. I mean, look at um Pam. Pam, Pam like girl, get your whole life. Yeah. Not this one though. This one I don't. Electric Bloom don't hit like this. Electric Bloom, Bloom is not as cool as this because I know that's the one you're probably thinking of, man. Um, and even in this one, I really like, I don't. Even, I wouldn't even wear that, so I'm lying.
you might be right. I'm going to keep these two for right now. These two light ones, we're we going to we gonna put on Macari. It'll it'll be it'll be a blessing to somebody else. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Damn, okay. All the LYS blushes. I have five of the six. I have this shade here, which is self-love. I love this shade. I don't use it enough, but I'm keeping it. Actually, I'm going to keep all of the LYS. Actually, I bought it today. Kim, I'm going to I'm going to do a video on it. I'm going to actually do a wear test. I might do the wear test tomorrow. I might not since Maya has a tournament. I have to stay masked for the whole tournament. I don't think that's a fair thing to do during a wear test. So I might not do it tomorrow. I might do it Monday. But yes, I did purchase it. Um, this one, this is Empower. Yes, yeah, she stays. All the LYS is gonna stay. I can tell you that right now. Yeah, look at that. I haven't used that shade yet. This is Passion. Passion stays. I, I'm, I'm keeping it. LYS formula is everything. Look at that. I can't wait till the summer. Inspire. And then Kindness. Kindness is the only one. That I might not keep. I haven't even touched it. That looks that looks like it's just not going to really do anything, doesn't it? What do you think? I think if I didn't keep any of my, this is the one that I would have to get rid of. I've been thinking about decluttering only because they're not getting used. Did you get thirteen? Or 14. No, I got 11. 13 and 14 are too too deep for me. I got 11 neutral. Hopefully that works. I hate her shades. I can never pick out the right shade. And I very much dislike the original one. So that's why I, I was on the fence about getting it. But I'm going to try it. Pam, can, 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 that's what I said. I'm like, it's ridiculous how much money I spent on stuff I'm not using. So I'm like, yo, let me, even if I just make the tax back at this point, I want to get rid of this, some of this stuff. Hey, Carol, Carolyn, happy um, new year to you too, honey. Um, What do you think? This one got to go, right? I'm going to get rid of this one. I'm going to keep the other four. Hey, AF. Hi. Look at this. Y'all see this drawer? All right, y'all. Now, we get into pack. No, I'm not decluttering, but I have an extra. <laughs> this one will go on my Macari. This extra one is in the shade. And that this extra one came because she accidentally sent me the wrong shade. She sent me two shades and then and when I ordered the bundle of the whole nine, one of the shades was repeated and was missing a different shade. So she told me to keep this one. Right? Um, and this is the light shade. What shade is this? Floritaceous. Uh, let me see if I can find it so I can show y'all what it looked like. Here it is. Pam, you're not going to be able to wear this shade. You're not going to want it. I don't even wear this damn shade. You see that light that shade? I bought all nine. I'm going to be honest with you. I probably could declutter this one too. I'm not though. <laughs> but this one right here is the shade I got an extra of. So this one will go on Macari. This one I'll keep. But I'm not, I don't see myself using it. Now you're going to make me look at all of them. Because there's a few of them in there. Divine Rose is is, is cute, but it's, that's not going to show as much either. What's this one? 
Nifet I, I use as a topper. Nifet can stay. Am I really about to declutter something? Cherish can stay. I honestly, the rest of them can stay. Um, Electric Bloom can stay. This one is Nude Venus. I use that as a topper and you can actually, I actually can use this also on my no makeup days. It just gives it a little, little flush. Um, and these are the three that stay in my drawer, like my top drawer. This is um, Love Struck. Love Struck, I do wear quite often. I also wear Paradise Venus. This is what I have on my cheeks right now. This one, I love. Um, and this one is Desert Orchid. This is a great topper as well. And for my no makeup days. So these stay. And Desert Divine Rose, it does come out on me. It's just going to look a little more plummy, light peachy, light peachy plummy. It's this one that doesn't show. It doesn't show at all. It actually can't even be a topper. Why keep it, you ask? No clue. But I'm not going to get rid of it right now. I'll get rid of the extra one. But this one stays. We coming down to the wire. We coming down. Too light. Got to go. Oh, gosh. Y'all are right. Y'all are right. Y'all are right. Holy crap. Why keep it, right? But I might have a client I can use this on. All my clients are melanated for the most part. But still, I could. Am I really going to even put this on them? Anybody? Not really. This is light. All right, y'all. We're going to declutter that one. That one. Um, cause I wouldn't even put that on a client. Keep for a client. Chai, really? You think? <sighs> it's got like a cool tone to it. Y'all, I don't know. Y'all got me sitting here sweating, worried. Like, really? I did not expect. I did not expect to declutter a pat blush. All right, I'm gonna declutter the blush. I am because I don't see my. I and I would use one of my palettes. Didn't we say I'm keeping the Sephora ones for clients? Demo with a blush. Let's review it. Really, it's not gonna show up. Especially not gonna show up on these cheeks, honey. It's just not. But I'll get a clean brush and y'all can see for yourself. Look. I don't have anywhere to put it because I already have blush on. Look, I'm going to go like this and y'all going to see for yourself. Can't even see. You can't see it. Look. It's nah. That helped me. Nope. Not keeping it. You can't even see it. I'm good. All right. Okay. Next are all my Clinique blush, uh, what are these called? Cheek pops. I have 10. You know what? <laughs> what Pam said is dis disappear. <laughs> disappear. Yes, it you can't even see it, you know? So it's all right. It's going. I I, I I'm good. But these, but these cheap pops though, y'all gonna have to help me because I love 
the cheek pops. Okay. This one can stay. This is black honey. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. This one gets a lot of love from me. It's broken in the pan, so I have to be careful. This is ginger pop. Let me tell you, the formula on the cheek pops is everything. I just broke, I broke this one not too long ago because they're very delicate. This one is fig pop. Damn, I broke it. Let's see if I can press it back in. This is fig pop. These are great for travel. Um, some of these shades though, I don't need. This is Cola Pop, y'all. This one right here. Y'all see it? So now we're going to get into some of the lighter ones that I know I need to get rid of. This one right here, Melon Pop. The melon one, though. Nah, the melon one got to go. Y'all got me with the brush out. So let's see. The melon one is actually ashy. I can get rid of that one. This one. This is baby marble pop. This is like a lilac. I don't see lilac being something that I can rock. I bought it because it looks so pretty in a pan. <laughs> you know, I get suckered in really, really quick, right? But y'all can clearly see that this is not for me. I'm dropping bars now, like nah. So we gonna get rid of this, okay? This one, however, this one is Heather Pop. This one is a little different. It does come um, show up on me, um, but it is a tad bit on the ashy side, right? So it's not giving everything for me. So we're gonna, I'm gonna let go of this one as well, right? Then whew, we have Berry Pop. Berry pop is gorgeous. Berry pop stays. Berry pop is all about the summertime. Now, if you look at plum pop, plum pop is very similar to berry pop. Berry pop has just a little more umph to it plum pop it's just a little it's not as it's a little more subdued i'm gonna swatch them because we need to see this is berry pop this is plum pop I think I'm going to keep berry pop and I'm going to get rid of plum. Yeah. So I'm going to keep this one and this one I'm going to get rid of. Yeah. All right. I wasn't even expecting. Didn't I say I thought I was going to keep everything? Okay. Last one is pink pop. I can tell you right now, y'all going to be like, yeah, you, know, you can, you can let that one go too. I am so shocked. I'm so glad I did this live. Because y'all, I wouldn't have did nothing. That's Pink Pop. Right? And this is what Pink Pop looked like. I think I can get rid of this one. Oh, wow. So I kept five. And I got rid of five. I got rid of these five. And I kept the deeper ones. Okay. That's good, y'all. I did good, y'all. Y'all help me out. 
Jesus Christ. Okay. <clears throat> we just have a little more to go. Anyone doing a low buy this year? Nope. I I I couldn't even do it. Y'all, when I tell you what I got for Christmas, I couldn't even do the video. I said I ain't even doing this video. Mm -mm. You know how people when got their stuff for Christmas and, and what they got. Mm -mm. All I can tell you is I lost my natural mind. Like, oh, it's crazy. I even bought, I bought a Peloton yesterday, y'all. It'll be delivered in three weeks. Your girl's about to be snatched. But I bought a Peloton. So when I get it and it's set up, I'm going to be asking for everybody little handles or whatever so that y'all can, we can keep each other motivated so I can get on the get right. Okay, because this keeping me indoors and all of this and all of that, it, the secretary spread is bananas. Okay. All right, I'm trying to get snatched like Pam. Y'all saw Pam in that black dress? I said, Whoo, Pam, I saw you, girl. I saw you, boo. I saw you. I was like, look at Pam. Well, damn, Pam. Y'all saw, y'all need to go see it. It's one of her stories on one of her stories or her um, IG lives. I said, no, Pam is serving it all the way up in that black leather dress. Hunty, I said, hold up. Yes. Yes, I said, look at Pam. Pam showing out. I said, that's what I'm talking about. So, I bought me a Peloton. Because I had bought a lot of pocketbooks. And a lot of a lot of luxury sneakers and pocketbooks. And all kind of been wilding out. And I said, before I buy me another bag, shoe, or fragrance, I'm going to buy something for my health. So, I bought a Peloton. And so it will be delivered at the end of the month. Yes. Um, Westman Atelier. This one is Papette. Papette says. Shoot, I just messed up my little. And then this one is Dodo or Doo Doo. This one stays. These two I really like. These are my only two. These two I keep. We have six blushes left and we're done. Six blushes and we are done. Okay. I'm keeping both the Westman Atelier because I do like the formula and I like it. Y'all ready? I know Chai gonna be like, no, because she don't like the packaging. But the six cover effects is. This one right here is Spice Cinnamon. This one is um, Mojave Moth. I might get rid of this one. I might get rid of this one. Um, this one is Warm Honey. I do like this one a lot. I didn't declutter the contour. I kept the contour. I ain't messing with you. I kept it. Um, this one is Sweet Mulberry. Isn't she gorgeous? This one I love. Isn't she gorgeous? Um, this one is Soft Peach. I keep this one. This is a beautiful peach. I keep this one. And this last one is Pink Dahlia. So honestly, I think what I'm going to do is Pink Dahlia and Mojave Mauve are the two I won't keep. I think these are the two I won't keep. I will keep the others that are deeper, right? Um, but the mauve, I have a, I have enough mauve. And this pink one, I don't need. I think I'm going to get rid of these. I'm going to get rid of these. All right? And I'm going to keep these four. I was not expecting to do that. 
right? But I'm going to keep these four. And I think we're done. I think we're done, y'all. Oh, shoot. I forgot about this highlighter, but this is brand new. So I'm keeping this. This was the beauty wand thing. Everybody talks about it. So I did, I did grab one because they're never in stock. So during the sale, they were in stock. So I did keep, I did get that. And today, just so you know, I purchased a blush. All right. Cause, <laughs> and it, it, I purchased it because it's not available on the merit website. And that's the merit brush blush. I am doing a, um, collab with them. Right. Or sponsorship with them. They didn't have the blush to send me. They did send me the rest of the products. They're on their way. So I wanted to have the blush in order for me to do a full face. So I bought this. So this days, but that's it. Now, now, oh, the Surat was a maybe. We never said what to do. Some said keep it. Some said not to. I'm going to keep it though because I need it for future videos anyway. But that's it. So if I look at what I decluttered, let me close this. Um, I'm going to count really quick. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. 22 blushes. Nope. 24. Nope. I'm lying. Uh, more than that. 22, 24, 26 blushes. I decluttered 26 blushes. Come on, y'all. I decluttered 26 blushes. And I decluttered mother. Y'all never would have thought I would have decluttered mother. But I decluttered mother. Okay. I decluttered Hermes. Okay. I decluttered um, a bunch of stuff. Fenty, Charlotte. I even decluttered some Dior when it comes to the... Um, Highlighters. Remember, I declared the highlight, the Dior highlighter. Y'all, I did good. I did good. I'm, I am super duper happy. Okay, and wait till y'all see what I decluttered from my fragrance collection because <laughs> I needed to do a quick declutter because it was out of control. Okay, um, so I even decluttered a Tom Ford. I still have 17 after that, but I still decluttered a time for it. So look out for that video at the end of the month because I'm not going to spoil it and tell y'all what I decluttered, but I did declutter about 25 fragrances. So y'all see that at the end of the month. Off topic, because I can't wait. I did keep the two girls new for right now. For right now, I did keep it because I'm going to mix it and I want to play with it and see if I can like it right but i will tell you that the tom ford fragrance that i decluttered was oudwood intense it was it's too it's too wood for me it's too oud and wood i thought about keeping it just so i can mix it with something else but i didn't so that's that's the tom ford one that i've had on on my list and i barely used it so Somebody is going to get blessed with it because I doubt that I asked for a lot of money when I put it on my Macari. Okay. I think it's for it is for a man. It was too masculine. It was way too mad. Yes, Pam. It was way too masculine. And I started to give it to my brother. But when my brother tried it, he was like, yo, I can't wait. This is too much. He liked Dolce Cabana Blue, whatever that is. Um the in the dark blue bottle anyway you know but he took my ombre leather because I, I actually decluttered that he took that at christmas so i didn't even get a chance to film that one but he did take my ombre leather so those are the only two tom fours actually that i don't have in my collection anymore um it was it was just leaning way too masculine but let me not to get on to the subject of fragrance but now that we are here i have to tell you this okay can you give the deets on that? I will um give I will link my Macari, but nothing will be on there for like another week. Um, at least, right? Um, because it's just it's crazy in this house, right? Um, right now. Um, with volleyball starting and all, you know, back up and all this traveling and then school, it's a lot, but it will go in there. Any yes, 
It was plenty of shoe purchases, Chai. I've been out of control. If y'all want to stay on here for 10 more minutes, I will show you what I bought. But I'm telling you right now, I was out of control. I bought, I bought two Louis Vuitton bags in a week. Right? And in case y'all didn't know, I'm a Louis lover. I am a straight up Louis lover. Okay? Um, I, I also purchased a pair of Chanel boots. I purchased, actually, I wore them today too because it was snowing. Or yesterday, um, I bought a Burberry sneaker, a Gucci sneaker, some other sneaker. I can't even remember. It was out of control. I've been, I've been wilding out. It's been, it's, is the never full worth it? I don't know. I don't have a never full. I don't like it. I don't like the never full, so I don't have it. Um, I like my totes to drop lower. They can't be ready to get deodorant. I'm a big girl, you know what I'm saying? So. When I put a, a, a arm on, I mean, the, the handles on my shoulder, I don't want it underneath my arm. You know, I, I, it's too close. I like it to drop a little lower and the never fold doesn't drop low enough for me. So I don't own one. Um, and my daughter bought me a, a Michael Kors tote for Christmas. God bless her heart. She, she was hiding it and everything. I, and I had yelled at her that day for spending money. I didn't know that's what she was doing. I was like, I looked in her account and I got noted, notified that she spent all this money. I was like, the hell are you doing in the mall while and now I got on her about budgeting and stuff. And she had bought me a bag. I just didn't know. But anyway, I don't have the never full because I, I just, it doesn't hang low enough for me, but I'll be right back. I'm going to show y'all the bags. Just give me one minute. Okay. She is sweet. She's very sweet. She was, I was supposed to be going back in the office in January before the outbreak. So she was like, you know, I have my work laptop and then I have my laptop that I use personally for school. So she was like, you can carry your work laptop and your MacBook. And it is, she was just so happy that she was able to do something for me that I was just like, I was like overwhelmed on Christmas because I was I was so shocked. But anyway, okay, so I have the Pachette Matisse. I had, did a video last year, I think early last year, unboxing it or whatever. That was my everyday bag. I love that bag. I absolutely love that bag. And I don't own, let me, let me take that back. I have one black bag in my entire collection. I don't do black like that. I don't do black bags like that, right? Um, but I wanted a nice leather black bag. So I bought the Pichette Matisse in the empreinte leather. So, and I, I always put Twilly's bandos on my handles. So I did purchase this bag uh, right before, a little bit before Christmas, a couple weeks before Christmas. I purchased this bag. I absolutely adore this bag. You know, the, they, I keep the straps in there. But this bag holds so much. I love the Pichette Matisse. Um, Pam, don't you love their bandos? They just came out with some. I have to call my, my CA because there's a couple of them that they have that I want. And you can just carry this one like this if you want to. You could dress it up. You could dress it down. So I went ahead and got it. I love that back pocket. I could slip my phone in the back pocket. I love this bag, right? And so because I have it in the CA was like, you sure you want the same bag? Yes. I'm sure I want the same bag in a different style, a different color. I know I have the regular monogram. That's fine. But this is the one that I, I, I got recently. Then my girlfriend was in the Madison, Madison Avenue store. The flagship store in, in Manhattan, and she was like, um, I was see it. She was visiting RCA and she was like, She has the speedy. I don't need the speedy, but I said, Go ahead. She put it on her card and I dealt her the money. 
So I got a Speedy 25. These are very hard to get because they're not even available. Every time you go online, they'll tell you, you know, it's not in stock call or whatever. So I got the Speedy 25. This thing holds a whole lot. I actually wore it today, but then I emptied it out because I'm not wearing it tomorrow. So um, I got the Speedy 25. All my fragrances going on Macari. Yes, they will go on Macari. Um, let me just put these back. I'm going to grab the shoes and then I'm going to let y'all know. Yeah, I know y'all. It's extra. It's really, really extra. I have to do with the clutter as well. I'm not keeping. Okay. Yes, thank you, Chai. Please, if you haven't done so already, like the video. This is insanity. Um, okay. So I've been at home for two years now. We all have for the most part, right? For those of us that work from home. So instead of buying heels, more heels. Right, that I have nowhere to go where I started um, building a, a larger sneaker collection, right? Those of you who don't know, I already collect Air Force Ones and stuff because I'm a sneaker head. But anyway, so I got these. These are the 1977s by Gucci. I love these. Um. I I have no intention on wearing them anytime soon. These are going to be held for the spring, but these are gorgeous. It's a gorgeous tennis shoe. They're fabulous, darling. So I got these from Bloomingdale's. They actually come in this denim. They come in high top too, and they come in a tan. With the canvas, right? Um, my daughter actually got those. Oh, well, I got those. She didn't get those. I, she ain't got no money. I got those for her in the high top ones. But um, yeah, so I got these. I gotta be careful and put these down. I don't want no blush to get on those. Okay, these I got. These I got in November, maybe a little earlier. And I've already worn these. These are very comfortable. These are the runaway, I think they're called runway or runaway, one of the two, because they match all my LV bags. So um I actually wear these even to practice or whatever. I wear those. Can we see the tan? I I think she's filming for her um for her project, so I can't go in her room. But I have a friend of mine who works at um Bloomingdale's. So actually, um, once a month, they, they get a, um, a chance to use the, their employee discount gets larger. And sometimes they include Gucci. Well, for December, they included Gucci. So I got 30% off. So just so you know, I did not spend full price. I got the sneakers for 30% off. So pays to know people that work in retail because, you know, they, they be hooking your sister up. But I got these. These are extremely, extremely comfortable, right? They just had a price increase, unfortunately. So they're like $100 more than what I paid for. But um, I got those. These just came in from Saks. So um, I already have a Burberry bag. So um, I like the fact that it's mostly black. It's only the little plaid on the sides, right? So this is a very cute shoe that makes you your foot look extremely small right 
So I say, damn, you need to make a dress. If you're gonna make if you're gonna snatch my foot like that, can you snatch the rest of my ass like that, man? <laughs> Seriously. So um I got these. These are not over the top, they're very chic and just simple. Um so that's that's kind of what drew me to them. I won't wear them right now because they'll get ruined in this weather that we're having in Jersey. But yeah, so I got these. And I told y'all I was wilding out. Then I have I have stuff in these. These are what I wore today. And these are my Chanel boots. You won't even know they're Chanel without looking. And I can appreciate that part. You have to look at the very side. And nobody's going to be that close to my, my, my feet. At least they shouldn't be. And it just says Chanel here. Other than that, you wouldn't even know it was Chanel. And these boots are mad comfortable. And they're cut true to size, unlike the rest of the Chanel footwear where you got to go up a whole size. So, yeah, your girl's been wilding out. I've been, been wilding all the way out. Yeah, but that is it's subtle in its design. The only people that are not subtle is is, Louis, is 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 LV. You know, I have these and then I have a pair of sandals, but other than that, I don't particularly care for the rest. Um, the acrylic holders for your pat eyeshadows. This one right here, Amazon. No, I'm lying. Yes, Amazon. I got this from Amazon. Thank you. You ain't wearing your Chanel in the snow. Listen, boots was made for walking. Like, I'm not going to wear, like, they're really, they literally all leather. So you can just wipe them off. It's not, con and they, they give you an extra set of laces. Um, so I literally bought those for this type of weather. So I, I don't, I'm going to get my use out of them. My cost per wear, I'm going to get that bad boy. You better believe that. You picked up a pair. Which a which pair? I want to know, Pam. You got DM me, Pam, which pair? Because I almost bought a pair and I said, nah, I'm not doing this. And I ended up getting the Chanel instead. Yep. I didn't give the name. It's it's my name, Chris Loves Lux. That's the name on my Macari site. That should be easy. I think I'm the only one out there. It said Chris Loves Lux. That's exactly the name on my Macari. Mm-hmm. Do they keep your feet? Yes. For me, they do, but my feet stay hot, though. FYI, right? But yes. Yes. All right. All right, y'all. We've been on here for two hours and 43 minutes and counting. Okay. So I appreciate everybody hanging out. It's still almost 40 of y'all on here. I so, so, so appreciate you guys. And I didn't get a chance. My phone was going off. It's dead now. My phone was going off. I saw a few of you send me something in, in, in um, Cash App. My Cash App was going off. So I appreciate that. In my Cash App is Chris Loves Lux. My Zell is Chris Lux. No, my Zell, not Zell. Venmo is Chris Loves Lux. I appreciate all of you that dropped me um, uh, uh, a gift to support the channel. I so, so, uh, so appreciate it. Um, please. We go hard for your lives. Oh, thank you so much, sis. I appreciate them. I appreciate all of the love. I appreciate everybody hanging out. I appreciate y'all supporting me. You know, I know that I am not as consistent as I used to be, but y'all know I'm about that doctorate life. Your girl is trying to get that doctorate. So in between that and all the work at work and everything else, it's been hard, but I'm trying to make sure I get y'all the stuff that y'all want to see look out I, my my perfume tray will be coming out so will um my review on that eating apple i'm gonna tell you right now that was on my declutter list too okay that new kayali fragrance is on the declutter list okay but i did do a very very short uh review on i don't even think it was 10 minutes and y'all know all my videos are long but not that one that was short and sweet mm -mm, okay so that one will be coming out soon, the declutter video. And then 
of course, my Pat video and some other videos will be coming out. So I'm going to try to get it to you as consistent as I can. I appreciate when y'all come check on your girl. I love y'all so, so, so much. I really, really do. Finally, the truth. What? About that damn girl. Pam, don't get me started. Or I, mm, mm, even my daughter don't want it. My daughter don't want it. She was like, I don't want that. She smelled it and was like, mm, no. <laughs> okay, let me stop. I'm giving it away. But girl, I, I was not. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That wasn't for me. Anyway. All right, y'all. Listen, have a blessed night. I need to go clean this up so I can get ready because we have to. she has to be on the court at 8 o'clock in the morning. So I'm going to close this out. I'm not digging her stuff. No, I wasn't digging that. Yes. Oh my gosh. That was a perfect a perfect intro. Wait, perfect outro. $100 stripper body splash. It is, it's just not it's just it wasn't for me. Okay? Good night everybody. Love y'all. Stay please stay safe. Stay masked up. Stuff is real out in these streets, okay? Have a great night. Great rest of your weekend. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.